I'm Kevin McCormley of Kiplinger's to tackle a tough issue that's even rougher in today's economy, whether to try to sell your home yourself to save the commission or hire a pro to do the job. Janet Bodner and Kim Langford lay out the pros and cons. No doubt about it, selling a home is expensive. The latest figures show that the average real estate commission is 5.4% and many agents are still able to command the traditional 6%. On a $300,000 home, 6% will cost the seller $18,000. Now that's a lot of money, but this is a big job, and you'll probably be better off hiring an agent if you've never sold a home before, if you're short on time, or if your market is highly competitive. In most areas of the country, it's a buyer's market. There are a lot of homes for sale and relatively few buyers. A good agent can price your home at a level that will attract potential buyers based on what comparable homes are selling for in your neighborhood. Set the price too high and your home can languish on the market, too low and you could leave thousands of dollars on the table. You'll also get advice on how to make your home more appealing. A top-notch agent will be on the cutting edge of marketing, using the latest in technology to get the word out that your place is for sale. And newspaper ads are great, photographic web tours can be dazzling and you'll get valuable help evaluating bids, negotiating the contract, and handling all the legalities of settlement. Thanks, Janet. And now Kim Langford lays out the case for do-it-yourselfers. FISBO, it's got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? That's what they call for sale by owner, FISBO. Avoiding that fat 6% commission you'd have to pay an agent to sell your home has a powerful appeal. And going the FISBO route can be quite profitable if you have the time and energy to market and show your home. Your first job is to set the right price. As Janet said, if it's too high, potential buyers will walk away. If it's too low, you could be cheating yourself. Believe it or not, local agents may be willing to give you a hand finding comparable sales. They figure if you're unsuccessful as a do-it-yourselfer, you might reward them with a listing. To give your marketing efforts a professional touch, you can buy a yard sign at a site such as ForSaleByOwner.com, which also has advice, checklists, and state-specific real estate forms you can buy. You'll have the best chance at making a sale if you advertise your home on a multiple listing service. That's where buyers are sure to look. For $395, Owners.com will post your home on the local MLS as well as on Realtor.com. And if you advertise a 2% to 3% commission for buyer's agents, you'll entice them to show your home to their clients. I hope this discussion helps you decide whether to hire an agent or go the FISBO route.